discoveries from ancient Egypt have spanned hundreds of years of adventure and exploration. From early adventurers to forensic scientific analysis, each discovery has shed a new light on a civilization that began 50 centuries ago. The ancient Egyptians were the, simply the most fascinating and entertaining people that ever lived in the ancient world. But Egyptology holds more than fascination for academics and scientists. It has a resonance that affects the modern world, even today. The ancient Egyptian legacy is still alive, 2,000 years after the civilization itself collapsed. They are the mother of many, many cultural traditions that we consider our birthright even in America or the European context today. One of the most important legacies left to modern life by the ancient Egyptians is the science of medicine. The earliest record of a professional physician in history was a man named Imhotep, working in Egypt nearly 5,000 years ago. The surgical skills of the ancient Egyptians were developed, not to keep a person alive in this life, but for a completely different reason, to preserve them for the next. Studies made on the mummified bodies of pharaohs have revealed the great expertise the Egyptians developed in dissection. Successful mummification was a complicated procedure that involved careful removal of key organs without damaging the body itself. Just as in many types of modern surgery, it required a deep knowledge of anatomy. In some cases, this knowledge has been passed down unchanged through the ages, right into modern medical textbooks. And medicine is not alone in the debt it owes the ancient Egyptians. Modern engineering and construction techniques rely on the knowledge developed along the Nile Valley over four and a half thousand years ago. The Great Pyramid at Giza is built with such accuracy that its width varies by less than two inches across its 750-foot length. The Greek genius Pythagoras is known as the father of numbers. He trained in Egypt. Here he developed algebraic formulas that provide much of the basis for modern engineering and construction. The more modern scientists explore the world of the ancient Egyptians, the more they reveal the debt that we owe this civilization. The quest for new discoveries is being pursued every day. It's up to new people to kind of come around trying to discover if there's any more you know, discoveries of this type to make. But that's an exciting way to, to do the search. One new avenue for investigation lies in the Valley of the Kings. From the tomb of Seti I to the treasures of Tutankhamun, the valley has produced many of the most important discoveries of ancient Egypt. But it may still hold more undiscovered secrets. This was confirmed by the discovery of a new tomb in 2006 called KV-63. Many scientists believe there are more undiscovered tombs in the valley. I think not all pharaoh's uh, burial sites are known, so I think the opportunities are still there. Text records list many more pharaohs than the number of tombs discovered. That's the exciting part of it, that there's at least one validation of the concept. New scientific analysis is revealing ways to begin the search for new tombs. Archaeologists are suggesting that the ancient Egyptians surveyed natural weaknesses and fractures in the rock to make it easier to carve out the tombs. So once you find the zone of fracture concentration and ex extrapolate its trend, the tomb builder could follow that by good fortune and he would stay right along it because it's almost a straight line. Richard Perizek is surveying these fractures in the Valley of the Kings. Now this is a zone of fracture concentration that, and you'll notice uh, the fracture pattern just jumps right out at you. If the ancient engineers dug tombs along fracture lines thousands of years ago, then fracture lines are a good place to look for a new tomb today.
that gives you some search pattern you know, that might say, look, if you're going to go looking, take a, include this as part of your search technique. Only time will tell whether this approach will produce a discovery as extraordinary as the tomb of King Tutankhamun. But all archaeologists agree on one thing. There are more discoveries to be found. Future generations will have a different idea of the top ten discoveries and their importance because of the scientific methods that continue to evolve in archaeology. As scientists follow in the footsteps of early pioneers like Carter or Belzoni, they continue to make new discoveries. You never know what the sand of Egypt may hide of secrets. These secrets are revealing not only the mysteries of an extraordinary empire, but also the powerful legacy that 3,000 years of civilization left for the modern world. And while the modern world continues to wonder at today's greatest discoveries, the discoveries of tomorrow promise to bring even greater insight, amazement, and knowledge of one of the greatest civilizations in history. The lasting civilization of the ancient Egyptians.